Welcome to Fragrance Wheel, your number one channel for fragrance, fashion, and food. Welcome or welcome back to another edition of Fragrance Wheel where we talk about fragrance, fashion, and food. Uh, I'm in my kitchen, so we're definitely not talking about fragrance. Fashion, if you want to consider your boy in fashion, I'm, I'm, I'm in the real deal here, getting ready to do what I do. No, we actually talking about food. So before I give you the recipes or give you what I'm cooking today, I will suggest, encourage you to hit the like, subscribe, and share this information with someone. And hopefully we can take this journey together. Learning how to cook the most simple meals, however nourishing. It's time that we stop or reduce eating out and start meal prepping, doing something nice and, and nutritious for our body and our children. So today we will have an adult meal and we will have a children's meal. The adult meal is going to be a schnitzel and schnitzel can be made from a chicken, it can be made from pork, or it can be made from lamb. Today, I won't do pork, I won't do lamb, I will do chicken though. So we're gonna make them out of chicken breast and I will have a schnitzel salad. Very nutritious. For adults, I mean children too, but I like this one for adults. I wanna have chicken strips uh, for the children with sweet potato fries. So, let's get going. We're making sure we Thin out the chicken breast in a plastic bag until it's this thin. See how thin that is? See how thin that is? And uh, whatever you do, always wash everything, especially when you're working with uh, poultry, chicken, turkey, or uh, any kind of bird. Okay, have all my chicken parts uh, flat. I have my flour dip here. I have my flour dip here, then I have my egg wash here, and I have my breadcrumbs here, and I will put the final product in the pan. Okay, here is your schnitzel, chicken schnitzel, and you have a salad, you have lemon wedges, and you have cucumber dressing, homemade. Oh, this is going to be Excellent, and it tastes so good. All right, the recipes will be below. This is your adult meal. Okay, that's that. Chopped up potatoes. Now it's time to season them with the olive oil and all the seasoning that you see over here in the corner. And, and then I sprinkle them with a little sugar. That way, if you sprinkle them with a little sugar, that means they are caramelized and they get a little crispiness on them. So let's start our process. I'm gonna turn this oven on 400. Remember, you cook them on 400, well, about 15 minutes, 15 to 20 minutes. And all of them the kind of the same size, so they should be done here. Short. Sure. Okay, here's the outcome of the sweet potato fries. And mmm. They are delicious. So uh, we move on to the chicken strip. I'm now dressing the chicken breasts and uh, I will be cutting as much fat off of it as I possibly can. It's nice and lean as you see it. Okay, as you can tell, I have all my uh, chicken, my two chicken breasts cut up, and you can tell I'm using the chicken mat here. This is a little symbol to let me know that that's the mat I use for chicken and chicken only. Uh, that way you avoid cross-contamination, uh, food, as far as um, germs, and things, bacteria, and stuff like that, that chicken can pose a threat to uh, your life and uh, make you sick if you leave it out too long or if you cross-contaminate and cut something else on this portion of this board uh, before you wash it and bleach it you know 
killing all remaining uh, possible bacteria or spores or anything like that. So here's all my spices. I have paprika, I have garlic powder, onion powder, oregano, and then I have cayenne, salt and pepper, and of course my brown sugar in the back. What I've done is I cut a whole stick, which equals a half a cup of butter, and I will now melt this butter in the microwave, and then I will place in all the seasonings that I just showed you a while ago, and we will dredge this, the chicken, we will dredge the chicken uh, in the butter, and then, and the sauce, and then actually we will uh, place them on the mat, and then apply all the seasoning in it. And then we'll cook for about 25 minutes. Okay, there, there's all your ingredients mixed together. Uh, we're going to mix them. Okay, chicken tenders going in. Look, look good, don't they? They're not even done yet. Ain't even started to cook. Okay, here's my finished product. And that is your chicken strips with homemade sweet potatoes and a salad. That's the children's plate. Okay, we're back, but you can see I'm out of the kitchen, I'm back on the set. And I hope you all enjoyed your experience with me, uh, just cooking a little healthy, uh, because I believe that we don't cook as healthy as we used to, uh, being born in the country, raised in the country, eating that country cooking. Some of that country cooking wasn't as good for you, but it tastes good, but it wasn't as good for you. So now um, we prepared two meals, one being an adolescent meal, uh, consisting of chicken fingers and sweet potato fries. And then we did an adult meal, which consisted of chicken schnitzel, and that was prepared in extra virgin olive oil, and also with an av avocado salad. So hey, that's pretty healthy, if I might say so myself. And the dressing that was prepared with it was a sour cream, cucumber, creamy dressing from scratch, promise you. I believe that going through culinary school had taught me a lot of, about cooking and about health and along my path, I ran into a lot of sites and one particular caught my eye and it was Integrative Neuropathic Medical Center. And one of the articles, well, several articles were eating to your blood type. And it stated that a lot of people were get sick and have to go to the doctor because they have bloating and constipation, irritable bowel syndromes, things of that nature but it's not caused from anything other than what we eat. A lot of processed food, a lot of salt, and a whole lot of sugar. So what we need to do is we need to cut those things out of our diet and stop going out as much and start preparing meals in the house. You, know, you gotta learn how to cook, so you might well watch my show. And I cook healthy, I believe extra virgin olive oil, I believe avocados are in your salad. I believe in dressing your salad with extra virgin olive oil. And that way I know that you're getting nutrients and some things, we're gonna have more discussion and some things you eat and some things you don't eat. But I say the Integrative Neutropathic Medical Center offers you blood type, eating to your blood type. It'll show you foods that are harmful to your blood. It'll show you foods that are neutral to your blood. And it'll show you foods that are helpful to your blood based on your blood type. Now I ask this, I've asked a lot of people this, what is your blood type? If, if I look like I'm having deer in the headlight, yeah, that's what it's usually because a lot of people don't even know their blood type and they've been going to the doctor or they haven't been going to the doctor in lots of cases. And that's why they don't know what their blood type is. You must know your blood type. It'll help you in the long run because it'll make you, it'll force you to eat the foods that you're supposed to eat based on your blood. 
It's simple. It's like math. One, two, three. So just try it. But I, like I said, I hope you all enjoyed it. And I hope you all uh, ask for me, you know, ask for the recipe down below. I'm not going to just sit it, sit it down there, sit it out there. I'm not going to sit it out there. If you DM me and leave me your email and I'll, I would definitely um, send you a recipe. Just a little starters because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start doing a lot of starter recipes. Something real quick but something healthy because that's what we need to do. We need to change our diet. Now, remember, when you're not having a good day and your friends won't call you back, but you need to pick me up, just remember, Fragrance Wheel, where we talk about fragrance, fashion, and food. And don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, hit that bell icon, and hit all to make sure you receive a video every time I post one. And then share it. Because just like you want to eat right, and just how I learned how to eat right, very healthy. Other people want to learn how to eat right too. So that's all I have on this episode. But come back because the fall is here. And I'm going to spray. Mm. I got some woods. I got some sweetness. Mm. Mm -hmm. I got some good stuff. Come on back. Deuces. <laughs>